Uh, welcome back. Thank you so much for tuning in. What a wonderful show it's been. What a culinary journey I've been taken on by Lizette in our frugal feasting this morning. We've made a beautiful salad to start. We've had our mains. Or, um, unbelievable chicken made with citrus. In fact, citrus is the hero this morning. So our journey with the nachi comes to a close. Um, what are we making for dessert? We are making super healthy caramelized mandarins. Super healthy because with, it's a mandarin. And because that's healthy, we can have double thick cream, double Boom. cream yogurt, and some almonds. Um, and you have taken citrus to another level today. And I'm, I'm loving the textures involved as well. Um, mm. The almonds are going to add a little extra a little bit of um, crunch. health as yeah. well, which is, is good. A little extra nutrition. So um, start us off. We're making a nice make little syrup. A nice yeah. little syrup, a very simple caramel. It is just some caster sugar and wonderful cinnamon quill, oh, cool. a little bit of water, and just to up the flavour of mandarin. Just get it stuck in there. And what I'm liking about this is if you've got some of those that have been sitting there in that fruit bowl just a, a little bit too long that you might not necessarily be diving into, you don't let them go to waste. That's no. what a frugal feast is all about. Cook with them. They're going to have beautiful sugary content as well, um, the riper they are. So you're going to get that additional flavor. So you start boiling it. Initially, it's going to be incredibly pale. Okay. okay. And then after a while, you're going to have a real caramel like that. Ooh. Nice and deep coloured. And of course infused with a beautiful cinnamon yes. flavour. Just be and very then, careful with the hot sugar. Oh yeah, I don't think this is one for kids to make. No. That's one for <laughs> kids to eat. This wonderful syrup goes over sliced mandarins. You can do slices like these, all little segments. Oh, lovely. And then all we do... This is really... Are you just popping it straight into the... I'm pan? popping oh, yes. it straight you're, on there. You're just deconstructing, reconstructing, hey? Oh, my goodness. And you could, if you didn't want to do the cinnamon, you could pop a little bit of rosemary into the caramel. It would go oh, incredibly well. Something different, yeah. And you could also put in a bit of chilli if you wanted to. I'm There's no reason this. why chilli cannot go into pudding. Um, and I think this kind of really brings to bear the fact that when you've got this as your, your jumping off point, the citrus, you can take it in so you many different directions. And the fact that we've been able to create such a zingy, fresh and crunchy salad, that fennel salad, absolutely amazing, um, then create a hearty meal. And you said like in winter, we, we obviously really do love our, our more hearty yeah. meals. Again, the citrus adds that freshy zing. And now we've got the most beautiful dessert. There oh, that looks fresh. amazing. Congratulations. Well done, little dessert. Dessert. The keyword is dessert to 33728. We'll send you an ingredients list and you can start creating your own beautiful, beautiful dessert. Lizette, you are a superstar. Oh. Thank you so much. <laughs> I'm going to dive in and taste. Mm -mm. 